Emmett Golden, ESPN Cleveland. Larry, on that last play after the uh, the pick by Love, was he open for the shot? Uh, you know, was that the right decision there? That uh, towards made? Jordan? Yeah. Um, I, I have to go back and take a look at it. I thought, I thought he might have been open momentarily, but they they end up switching it. Mm-hmm. Um, and you know, with a bigger guy on Jordan. Um, you know he made he he made the right decision. If he didn't think he can get the you know if he can get the pass there, um, I, I'll, I'll live with his decision um, because he got a good you know he got a good look. Joe Varden, the athletic. Colin darted to the corner. Uh, it looked like the first action on that play was. Is he the first option? Um, no, he was not the first option on that play. Um, that play was 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 designed. Uh, to get early movement with with Colin and and uh, and Nick and uh, Kevin pinning for Jordan coming up and then Kevin coming into the pick and roll uh, and then slipping out. Um, so we we executed the play. We got a good shot. It just didn't fall. And then from a, a thirty thousand feet view here, you know you're not going to the playoffs. You've been doing that for for months, really. Um, so the games are not supposed to mean anything, but but the team is so young and and so many of the guys are coming back and and Kevin's here now and and all that. So do you feel like your guys are playing as though these games mean something? They are, they really are. And and after the game, um, you know, uh, I had a couple of the Clipper coaches just came up to me and just said, "Man, your guys are really playing hard." Um, and and I, you know, we've been we've been hearing that. Um, but but these guys have to understand. Um, actually, they, they they are playing for something, and it's called pride. Um, when you get in this situation, it's easy to roll over, you know. Um, but but the one thing that I want these guys to understand that you know you you, you got to you got you got to take the bitter with the sweet, you know. Some some sometimes it's not going to be you know the way you want it to be or you know, how you hope it'll be, but you still have to play through it. You have to play through uh, tough times. You have to play through adversity. You have to play when you're not feeling well. You have to play when you're having little, little nicks and pains. Um, and, and, and our guys are, our guys are doing that. And I'm, 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 I'm very, I'm proud of them from that, from that standpoint. James Rapine, 92.3 The Fan. Larry, you guys scored 40 points. In that first quarter, was wow. that just making shots? Or wow. Yeah, we that? made shots. We made shots, and I think we might have had five threes that 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 quarter, something, yeah, something, that something of that nature. But uh, we just got off to got off to a great start. I thought we got off to a great start. We were making shots, and and when you make shots, you know it looks good and it feels good. Um, but 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 you know to, to to Clippers credit, I thought they they tightened their defense up a little bit that that uh, that second quarter and kind of got after us a little bit. Um, forced us into um, a few turnovers and and a, a, a few rush shots, um, but uh, I was I was glad we were able to you know in that second half we were able to fight back and 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 um, you know we had an opportunity to tie or, or to win the game and, and we just came up short. What does it say about your guys that they got or they dealt with a counter punch from the Clippers? The Clippers were in control and then you guys did respond in that fourth quarter. Well, I think I think what it says is these guys are starting to to learn um and and, and understand um you know that when you do go through a tough stretch um against a good team. This Clipper team is a good team. Um and a physical team. And 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 those are those have been the type of teams that have given us the most problems because physically they 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 wear us down. But but we were able to we were able to to to, to weather the storm and and to su- sustain uh, changing up our defenses in the second in that second half. I thought it helped a lot too. But um, you know we've we we've shown that we can you know we can compete with some of the some of the better teams, particularly you know when we have a full squad and and we do have a we do have a full squad right now and it feels feels pretty doggone good. Angel Gray, Fox Sports, Ohio. What can you say about David Nawaba's impact on the game, especially taking on Lou Will? Not a tough guard. Well, Dave took took on quite a and few people tonight, um, and, and that's that's the thing that I really I really love about him. I know um, when I when I put him on a guy, I know that he's going to take he's going to make it a personal challenge to defend him. 
and Lou Will is, you know, he's as, as prolific scorer as there is in our league. Um, I thought Dave did a good job in making it tough for him. Um, I thought he did a good job in making him making him work. Um, you know, getting his hands in, slapping the ball away a couple of times. Um, but but he was really good from a team aspect too. He was in the right spots. Um, you know, I thought I thought he 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 played with a he played with a with a sense of urgency from the time I put him in the game towards the end of that first quarter to the time I took him out in the in the fourth quarter. Um, and that's what Dave brings to the table. He, he's that he's that energy guy who comes in. He defends. He rebounds. Um, you know, he gets it out off the glass and brings it out on the break. Um, I thought he had. Uh, he had he had a terrific terrific game. I thought he did a lot of a lot of good things for us.